learn how to draw a cuboid of given dimension on an isometric sheet so here you can see that we have isometric sheet this is an interactive activity you can download the software geogebra it's a free software the link is available in the description and you can also do the same in your machine so let us try to see if we are asked to draw a cuboid whose uh, length is 5 units, breadth is 2 units and height is 2 units. How we are going to draw. So we can uh, begin from any point. So here you can see I have taken a point A. And uh, for representing the length, we will be making a line segment by counting the distance between these uh, intersecting points so one two three four five so it is given that length is five units so here a b is representing the length then breadth is two units for that we will begin from the point a and go in the left diagonal direction two units one two and you see that we have reached to the point c so on the screen, now you can see point A, point B and point C. Now imagine we need to draw a cuboid whose height is 2 units. So we will be making line segments from these three points like this, vertically upwards. So 1, 2 units. So we leave it here from A also 2 units. Then from B also, 2 units, vertically up. And then you see that with the help of line segments, we can join and get a cuboid of given dimension. See how we have completed. And we know that opposite faces of the cuboid, they are congruent. And here in the isometric sketch, the stress is on, you, you see that two faces are visible, the front face and the side face, right? And this is the isometric sketch of cuboid. Let us draw another cuboid whose uh, length is, say, for example, four units. So we can start from any point. Now you see the process, one, two, three units. So we have marked one side. And then, say for example, its breadth is 3 units. 1, 2, 3. This is how we got, get the another point. And height is 2 units. So again, from point J, vertically up, 2 units. From point H, vertically up, 2 units. And then from point I, vertically up, 2 units. And now, it will help you in improving your imagination how you can complete the cuboid by joining in this fashion. Now you see. So this is a cuboid of dimension 4 by 3 by 2. Right? So see how easy it is to draw three-dimensional shapes on the isometric sheet. In the next video, we will be learning how to draw a cube on the isometric sheet.